All right, here's how you can upload your animation to Schoology to share it with everyone. Um, so right now I'm on my animation-ish page. I just made this quick um, practice animation. So remember, I've got my frames here. Frame one, I have a person standing. Frame two, they're a little bit higher. Frame three, they are even higher up. Um, remember, I can click play to watch it um, play back and forth like this. Um, now I want to upload it, though. So I'm going to click the Share button up here, and I'm going to download it as a GIF, G-I-F file. So I'm clicking on that, and it is saving to my computer. It just popped up down here so I can see it's saved um, to my computer. It's just called Download because I didn't actually save it yet um, on here. I can do that after. Now what I want to do is in a new tab, come to Schoology, and I want to go to my art course. I know that some of you don't have the, my course show up when you click courses. So remember, you could just click course dashboard right here. <laughs> and that will show all of your courses, even the ones that don't fit um, when you click courses up there. So you might have to scroll a little bit um, to find it. But here is what it looks like. It says fourth grade art has my picture. So I'll click on that. <coughs> Then um, for the practice one, we're going to upload it right here where it says animation practice. So I'm going to click on this. And I can already see some of the other uploads here. So I can see other people have already uploaded them. They're really fun to watch. You can click on it to see it a little bigger. Um, but to add my own, I'm going to click where it says add media. And then I'm going to click attach files. Then, um, since I just downloaded it, it should be one of these top ones. Here's the one I just did. I've got to click on it and click open. Then I'll click add media, and then it's added to the album. There it is, my person jumping. All right. 